hello guys it's your girl again chile i'm greetings to every one of you how you guys doing let's roll it hmm, my people this one is not shocking i don't understand what our country is turning into can you believe it i have never in my life ever thought about it that this could happen in nigeria i heard it happening in other western world but not in Nigeria. But I'm telling you, it's happening. You guys heard about what happened in Kaduna? 32 people lost their lives as a result. 32 people. Bandits are now using helicopter to terrorize fellow citizens. They came on bike. One hundred. I am. See, I had. I did read this news. Lanza, Lanza. Some of my people understand. I make it sinking. They came on one hundred and fifty bikes. Each bike was carrying three people. It means a driver in front controlling the bike, and two people on the bike behind the driver. So it means one person is facing right. Pointy is a weapon to the right, while the other one is pointy is weapon to the left. So both this bike is coming, so people are taking heat from right and left. That is the meaning of having two people on the bike. They were spraying periodically. Anybody touch it, touch. People were running heta skata, and as if you know, ended one hundred. Do you know what? 150 bikes me to store me into an area a particular place now they said the bike people don't even plenty pass the people when they did then the helicopter above them was not controlling them where to go and where people are they were come in communication eh so this one na 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 boko haram na full of yes men Oh, now, which one they call this one? What they say, not a, what an ice where they call her. What is going on in that country? As if this is not bad enough. The shocker of it all was that the military did not lift a finger to do anything about it. They called them, they knew about it, but there was no order from above. To tell them to attack these people. And they said before now that they gathered, there was an intelligence gathering. Information got to the military, informing them that these bandits they are going sophisticated, that they are trying to acquire more sophisticated weapons, and even uh, they are on the process of acquiring helicopter. Nigeria government did not do anything. Helicopter don't turn to banana and orange when they buy for street. They bought. Are you not telling me that the Western world do not control who buys these things? So somebody must have stood for them to buy this helicopter. Of course, the Western world are not stupid. They have regulations of how you buy these things. So somebody prominent must have bought this helicopter and handed it over to them to carry out this operation. It don't bad reach like that. The bandits now controls our army. Hey, my people. It don't say when they talk and say they don't infiltrate our army. I know believe. A lot of people don't believe. Now it is glaring and it is clear. Up to now, as I'm talking to you, there is no security report about that incident. In fact, people are not even talking about it. When I saw it, I said, ah, could it be true? The, the media, the major media has are not carrying it. Well, so I did for that, and it was true. It happened in Kaduna immediately after our incident. This one happened. But people are not talking about it. And you know, Kaduna, Satan and Kaduna is mostly, mostly dominated by Christians. But I am not saying that this particular area where it happened, that it was only Christians that died. I, we don't even know. But the number of people that died was 32. The next day, they still went out searching and they were still finding bodies. And I think they will still find more. 
why the Nigeria military forces are sleeping on this issue is what I don't understand. Does it mean they are enjoying it? Who is the head of the military? What is going on? What has Nigeria turned into? I weep for my country, Nigeria. What is going on? We are, we are sleeping and they have taken over the country. When we are busy scrambling for presidency, using 100 million to buy just presidential candidate form, even pastors are even among the madness now, collecting form for 100 million. Do you guys know what is on, not 1 million, not 10 million, not 20, not 50 million? 100 million. Guys, make a break up for now. Make you now understand. Million, million into 10. Million, million into 20. Go reach 100. That is what Tunde Bakari, who is a pastor, bought that form with. And other candidates. Nigerians are now making money. They are now making their citizen just to contest for the presidency. So how can the legit one contest? Of course, you cannot contest. If you are legit, you cannot have a hundred million. So it has to be all these corrupt politicians that will still be coming over because they are the ones that have the money. They are the ones that have packed the money. So they will still come. You see, we are just going from fry pan to fire. That is why we see the country getting worse and bad by the day. We are when it was Babangi that we were shouting. Abasha, we say. Ah, ah, Everybody came out. All the old women, they did naked. They swear for us. Abasha come out. Buari, would, Jonathan come. Hey, would they sing? Now, Buari enter. We never see Matete shout again. So don't think the next president is going to be better. It's just going to be getting worse because they don't infiltrate the country while we sleep. The Bible says, why men sleep? Devil plants ties to your plants. That is what is happening. Nigerians are sleeping. Our so-called men of God, whom they say that they, that they get breakfast with God, that they get that they eat breakfast with God, that they that they that they, that they, that they discuss with God for their bedroom every morning and every night. They're not the same way they happen. They are not talking about it. All of them are busy pursuing spiritual weights. When you gather, acquire all these weights, you go tell me where you go for eat these weights. Because this Nigeria one with the see so, it go become bloody grand. You yourself, they go wrong. You go remain me and every single one. We don't get money now. They, now they, they'll come be use as cheat. You see, their children, all of them day school for abroad. They, they get house, all of them they go, they go fly. Live now. That time, I go clear. So, guys, this era when we did an era of arm yourself and protect yourself, nobody is going to protect you. Nobody is going to fight for you. Don't even look at your man of God, please. And don't look at your government. I beg of you. These people are the people you put your trust and your mind in. But they are going to fail you big time. Just the way they have been failing you, that is how they will fail you big time. So, harm yourself. Shine your eyes, guys. Shine your eyes. I am just a concerned citizen. So I bring this awareness to you for you to be prepared so that you will not be taken by surprise on that day. Okay, guys, make I draw the curtain to a close for you. Make the video not too long. I beg, please, if you have not subscribed to this channel, support me by subscribing and clicking that notification button. It will go a long way of helping me. Thank you as you subscribe. See you guys on my next video. Bye for now. Ciao.